Hey there friends, it's Drew here from Hard Body Reviews with my update, Blu-ray update for the uh, Best Buy Trade and Save promotion or Upgrade and Save, that I guess they're calling it. Uh, I love this time of the year when they have this, it lets me get rid of some of these old DVDs I don't watch and get some cool Blu-rays. A lot of times they have some awesome movies for $9.99 that you get for $4.99, which you can never go wrong with. Um, <clears throat> sorry. So these are the ones I've picked up so far. I'm definitely going to make another trip back before it ends in February, but this is what I got so far. First one is... Midnight in Paris. I absolutely adore this movie. It came out last year. Woody Allen. It's really one of the only Woody Allen movies I've seen. And um, just the whole premise, just I knew I was going to like it with the fact that Ellen Wilson goes back in time, uh, talks to all these famous writers and painters in the 1920s. And that's just awesome to me. I, I romanticize the shit out of the past all the time. So I could really relate to this movie. And Ernest Hemingway is a, is a badass. And it's, he's so cool in this movie. It's unbelievable. And Owen Wilson is awesome as Owen Wilson. Beautifully shot. Some awesome color uh, tints on the film in this. And this is just a fantastic movie. If you haven't seen Midnight in Paris and you like dramedy or comedies, dramedies, whatever you want to consider this, it's definitely worth it. Um, next thing up, this wasn't actually from Best Buy, but I'll do it. This was at Target, and this is from the $5 section. That's Hostel 1 and Hostel 2, which that is an unbelievable deal. $5 for Hostel and Hostel Part 2. I haven't watched this yet. I don't know how good the uh, picture quality is, but it's through Mill Creek Entertainment, which I know they put out a lot of some budget stuff. It's not uh, just that shit one called. Whatever the one that... Ah, oh, fuck. What's that one called? The one that does the Halloween movies and Dust Till Dawn. That really shitty one. Echo Bridge. It's not Echo Bridge, so I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, but fuck it. Hostel and Hostel Part 2 for Five Bones. That's awesome. And now another trade and save is L.A. Confidential. Got this one for for $4.99. Uh, I have never seen L.A. Confidential, so I'm really looking forward to watching this. Heard nothing but great things about it. And, yeah, it's awesome. And lastly, for the trade and save, was this fucking sick Departed Steelbook right here. I had my eyes on this for a while. And uh, what better time to get it than with the trade and save? This came to $4.99 after the discount. This is a beautiful cover. You have the gut on the back. And then it's just the normal Blu-ray in here that was released for the other stuff. And lastly, this was an order I got through Amazon. Um, and that would be Bellflower. I loved this movie. Uh, I saw it on Netflix this year when it when it premiered on Netflix Instant. And this is one of the coolest movies I've seen. Pretty much this, the plot of this is it's these two best friends that are living in California. They're obsessed with the movie Mad Max and The Road Warrior. So they have this muscle car that they trick out and they build flamethrowers. And then there's a love story thrown into it and things get real fucked up. It's got an awesome soundtrack. It reminded me sort of of Drive in the sense that it's like an indie romance movie, but then shit gets real fucked up out of nowhere. And uh, that's Bellflower for you. And it's shot on some custom-made cameras that the writer, director, and star made. So it's got these beautiful... Uh, it, the cinematography on this is incredible. And uh, I can't recommend this one enough. Uh, if you're into like... If you like Drive and you're into those kind of really indie, uh, somewhat different movies then I think you'll you'll love this one and this comes in a slip case like that you take that off and this is just a uh, a digi pack which is sweet haven't had one of these yet for blu-rays so that just opens up Oscar scope apparently uh, distributed this shut damn it and um yeah so that's that and this isn't a blu-ray but I figure I'll just show this channel too um, Pick this one up online as well. That's the Into the Wild soundtrack on vinyl. Um, all the music on this was done by Eddie Vedder of Pearl Jam. And this is such an unbelievably good soundtrack. Uh, just every song on this is fantastic. And it's it's it, this is a pricey record. About like $35 or so I paid for this. But it's one I've been wanting for a really long time. So I'm so happy I have that. And um, yeah, that's, that's my update, guys.